Hi students, Miss George here. So I just wanted to show you a website that has been created to help um, keep you on track for your learning and make it easy um, to know what you need to do because obviously you've got five to six subjects and knowing what to do for each one might be might feel a little daunting. So in your um, year group team in the channel announcements for all students there has been a post created um, which says FGHS Learning Hub. There's also a tab up the top here, and this is probably the easiest way to get to it. So if you click the tab, the website will come up. Now the website has also been put on Facebook, but this way you don't need to go anywhere else but Teams, and you can click on this um, tab just here. It'll take you straight to the website. So. If you click on, um, obviously it's a smaller version, so if you click on the two arrows here that says expand tab, it will make it a bigger version so that you can explore it without having to squint. So on the first page here, it's got um, an adjusted timetable. So we still would like you to follow your same timetable. So when you have English, you do English work, but just having shorter periods. So making sure that you take some extra breaks um, to help you stay on track and keep focused when you actually are doing your learning and activities. So there's um, lots of different great resources on here that you can have a look at. The one thing I do want to show you is uh, going to the students tab and there's two key things that you need to make sure that you look at. So click on your year group, let's say we're in year eight. And up here, you've got class details and mode of delivery. So in this um, tab here, it's going to have all of the classes down the left-hand side and what, um, how the learning is going to be delivered. So whether it's going to be through Google Classroom, through Microsoft Teams, through Style App, through MathSpace, um, Maths is using. So you need to make sure that you are added to the Google Classroom and that you are added to the Microsoft team um, or that you have access to MathSpace, whatever is on here for each of the classes. If you are having trouble accessing any of those, you can send your teacher an email just here or you can reply to the post in Teams and I'll show you how to do that. So that's the first area that you need to look at. The second area that you need to look at is there's classes along here. So you need to click on your class and it's going to tell you what you need to do each week. So for example, in 8K History, you need to do um, all lessons and quizzes on Google Classroom. That's where you can find them all. But in week one, you've got three activities you need to do. So you need to make sure that you're in the Google Classroom and that you've done all those three things by the end of the week to be signed off for um, that lesson, for that um, subject. And then um, that teacher can provide you feedback on your learning and we can help you um, if you're struggling and um, you're ready to go then for week two's learning. So um, once you're in the website, there's lots of different information here. There's your electives and there's how-to guides. So if you don't know how to use one of the platforms, that's fine. Um, if you want to get back to the team, you just click these arrows up the top that says collapse tab. So the ones that you click to open it and then you can click posts. So if you click posts, you come back to um, the um, main page sort of thing for announcements for students. So if you're struggling to access the website, you can just click reply and type as a comment in here. Or remember, we've got the student support questions for staff over on the left hand side, and you can um, start a question in here. So have a play round, look at what's required for your subjects. Um, make sure you know how to get into Google Classroom and see, make sure that you've got all of your correct um, subjects in Google Classroom and in Microsoft Teams. And if you do have any problems, get in contact with your teacher um, or let us know through Microsoft Teams and we'll be able to help you out. Okay, see you later.